In this video, I will show you how to install and use the typographic design pack for Premiere Pro. So this typographic design pack for Premiere Pro has 400 plus elements which includes typographic slides that means the titles instagram stories social media and the lower thirds so this is an amazing amazing pack all of these elements have been designed professionally and they would certainly take your videos to the next level and before we go any further let's take a look at its promo So you can download these from the videohive.net or the Envato elements. The download link is in the description section below. After downloading, you will get a GIF file something like this, typographic design pack. You need to extract it using any unzip software like WinRR or 7zip and after extracting, you will get a folder like this. Just open this folder and inside it, you have the After Effects version and you have the fonts which are used in this. So if you just open this font text, so you need to install all of these fonts Montserrat, Open Sans, Real Scream and all these. Just go to their link and download and install on your system. And thereafter let's come over here. And the second is the GIF library. So these are some GIF which have been used in this. So for the Instagram stories these are have been used. Okay. So now let's come to the Mogat file. So this is the Mogat file and a help folder is also included so it has a video tutorial how to use these if you stuck anywhere you can refer to these videos or these tutorials otherwise you can just watch this video all right so now let's come to the mogat premiere pro files and inside it you have some folders one is for the lower thirds second is social media elements stories and typography so let me show you how to install all of these so these are around uh, let's say 50 mogat files for the titles all right so we need to install them in premiere pro and let's find out so i'm just going to copy this path because this is going to help us there is one easy way is just open your premiere pro and then go to the essential graphics so if it is not shown over here go to the windows and select the essential graphics that way this panel would be open right over here so if you have the latest version then you can just i think drag and drop over here so this is the title just drag and drop this mogat file over here and you can see boom this is available right over here so you can just drop all of these or there's another way you can click on this plus icon little plus icon and browse the files mogat files and select and then open that way that would also be available over here now let me show you the easiest way to install it that way it's not going to increase your drive size and it will just link those mogat files from the folder where you have downloaded it and for that purpose obviously you have to have a latest version 2000 i think 19 or above so thereafter you need to come over here on the essential graphics and this little hamburger menu just click on this and click on the manage additional folders and click on the add and that way it would be open the browser okay now you need to just paste that path which we have just copied or you can manually browse that as well right so i've selected this path and then select this folder so you just need to select the downloaded folder and thereafter press the okay and that way all of these titles would be available you can see right over here so these titles are now available so you can see title 15 title 89 so let me show you if you press the parenthesis key that's going to maximize it and you can increase the size of this so that you can clearly see them so i have so many things so maybe uh, you will see this title number 50 okay and the title number one all right so all of these are titles or typography pack which are included in this particular pack all right so you can use them over your project so all of these are very easy drag and drop 
elements okay so let me show you how you can use them so suppose i have this project okay and i want to just place it over here so i'll go and find the title which i like so for this purpose let's say by the way you can download some free titles from my website harshwardenart.com don't forget to check out some free and paid presets for premiere pro and the photoshop all right so let me just browse any of the title okay so i'll just have this one creative typography and i'll just drag and drop over my project and you can see and if you just play it let me just mute this one and see over here okay so this is how this animation looks and this is a heavy project and i need to render it out reason being that you can see this red line over here all right so but don't worry now let me show you how you can customize it select any of this and then you need to go to the again back to the essential graphics and in the edit panel if you selected this then only this edit panel would be available otherwise it would be grayed out so let me show you if i deselect this one then you can see this is it has nothing all right so we need to select this one this title or typography and then it would be available and all these options would be available all right so it may take a little while to load all all of these so now you can just change this font so this is creative typography so i'm going to write cool i can even change its font if i don't like this font so i can go over here and choose any other font all right which are installed on my system all right and then we have all these options to customize make it italic make it bold okay make it all caps all right so all of these things can be done we can scale it down scale it up so whichever way you want you can have it this way and then we have the option to change its color so we have the color text color one text color two and the color elements all right so if you want to change this text color to something else let's say okay you can see cool text when we can change the color of text two as well let's say let's make it something like let's select something from here and you can see this cool text effect now the color has been changed and then the color elements so i think this color element will change the color of uh, these elements maybe but i don't think so all right it has changed the element of this color all right so it doesn't have the you doesn't have the option to change the colors of these all right so uh, no problem let's bring it back to the white all right so this was the first okay now if you just play it okay so this is very amazing and you just need to render this out and then you would be able to see the real preview now let me show you the another one so this is the second one shadow let me drop it over here and come over here and uh, let's see the preview of it so if you just play it just notice over here oh this is little heavy so i need to just render it out i'm not going to render this out because this might take a little while so we can see the preview all right so now again we can customize this by selecting this one and going to the edit in the essential graphics panel so we have the option to change all of these colors so if you want to change this color to let's say something else this one okay and we can change this color to let's say this one this is changed and and then we have the option to change this uh, typography pack by my space all right so we can change all of these and we can change the small text and we can change this big text let me change it to and we can just since this is very large so let's scale it down so we'll come over here on this slider to scale it down so let's scale it down something like this and make it all caps and make it smaller even further okay and this is text this is the text you can change it all right so i have changed this text to this one okay now this has been updated you can see right over here all right so this is how you can use this and then we have some more options so let me just use this title so all of these titles are really really amazing i just really like this these animations and the colors and the effects which you have used you can see this is very very amazing amazing design 
so i'll select this and again we can go to the edit and customize all of these and let's find something else let's say title 42 and place it over here and if we just play it let's see all right so this is also very amazing so this pack is just just amazing so it has the instagram stories and other options so i'll go to the manage additional folder and click on the add and this time i'll just uh, find let's say social media elements for youtube okay and select this folder and press ok so now all of these youtube options would be available right over here so you can see youtube logo falling so i'll just drop it over here and let's see let's play it you can see the youtube logo is falling over here okay you can change it. again you can customize it by going to the edit and you can name your channel right over here so if you just play it let me make it one half isn't it this is very very amazing and let's find the second one youtube channel okay let's play it you can change this text again you can replace it with your own channel name and let's play this one youtube like okay wow this is amazing so it has lots of lots of cool amazing stuffs and you won't regret downloading this so if you are interested download this from the link in the description section below you can get it from the video hype or the envato elements envato elements is a one-stop subscription for unlimited downloads unlimited assets and you can get the royalty free music you can get the video templates stock videos stock images wordpress items and much much more so this is just one subscription which gives you access to everything so i already got this and i'm just loving this subscription because i don't have to pay for each item just i have one subscription i pay them monthly and then i can download and use any of these for my own work or for my clients work so this is an amazing if you are interested get it right now and don't forget to check out my website harshwardhanar.com for some amazing free and paid presets for the video editing or the photo editing premiere pro or the photoshop and if you are interested in learning how to add the cool seamless transitions on your videos in premiere pro check out this video so thank you so much bye bye see you in the next video till then keep shooting and unleash the creative in you